Hey friends and welcome back. So today I'm going to do um, a spread, my weekly spread. I gotta look at the date, my phone. Uh, the 29th through the 4th, excuse me, the 5th. And this was last week. What, did, what is this one? This is my social media um, because I was trying to work out a system. So some things are off. And then this is like my everyday. I didn't really do much in here. I really, did, to be honest, I didn't check my. Goodness. A planner this week. A matter of fact, today is Friday. Let me put that down. So this is we're gonna start because we're gonna probably be like April, May. Let me get some pages together here. So I think I'm gonna do horizontal, and this is just gonna be for my everyday carry. Uh, it's purple. Huh. I'm not sure if that's what I want to do. Let me look. What did I do for everyday carry last week? I did horizontal, but it was pink. So I'm going to go with the dashboard layout as far as my everyday carry is concerned. You all excuse my table. I have... Um, glue and everything else on here so I tried to be prepared and think of something but I don't have anything in mind right now I'm loving botanicals I'm loving farmhouse and this is simply lovely I'm gonna try to go through here I want a pink and gray that's kind of what I want is a pink and gray but I'm gonna try to stick to this one let me see So I think these three, I want to lean on the neutral side. So I have botanicals, I have farmhouse. It's probably going to be out of either one of those three. Um, we're going to be in probably botanicals. So let's get started. I may speed it up, I may not. Not sure yet. Well, for now, I'll just ch chat with you all. For one, last week was just something else. Like, oh, that doesn't cover that up. I was so busy working with that. Um, let me try something here. I was so busy working with my mini that I really, really, really just, oh, it, was just some, it was just something going on like every day. Like something, just something. I think I'm gonna do that. Leave it like that. Okay, we're gonna cover to buy. Yeah, so I didn't mean to leave y'all hanging, and I really do. I just have, I, I can't even begin to explain. I just, you know, try to be consistent, but it's very hard sometimes. Very, very hard. So busy, good times, meeting happens today, coffee first. But I definitely enjoy this. Um, while I'm doing this and we're going to be chit-chatting, I'll tell you guys, give you guys a few little updates to what I'm doing. One, I'm not going to let my um, shop go, but I'm just going to, whatever's in there, I'm going to leave in there and I'm going to... Uh, now to do today now let me do this but now here uh oh it's see through a 
fix that. Let me get some white out. So I'm not abandoning the shop. I just realized that I think I just did that shop. I'm not gonna say just did it. I don't know what I'm trying to say. I'm gonna do instead. So as I was saying, I just realized I've given away more than I've made and I just I went about the business all wrong. I'm I'm type I'm the type of person where usually I take my time with stuff as far as well let me stop lying. I take my time but I um it depends on what it is. I'll look into it, which I kind of did when it came to planning, and that's what kind of got me to where I am. I looked into the business, well, not the business, but I looked into planning and saw what all it entailed. You know, it looked like fun, but I let it just kind of get away from me. I saw that, you know, of course, money could be made, and I just dove in and didn't really... Um, do my research. I, I just, I went too fast. So I'm not saying that I'm not going to keep my shop. I'm just going to do the fun part for right now. I'm going to just enjoy it. I'm going to enjoy planning, which I really do. I enjoy uh, planning. So I'm just going to do that. I'm not going to worry about if something sells because if it sells that's fine if it doesn't that's even fine too but the store will be there um, I'm gonna just basically do what makes me happy and a lot of times you have to do that you have to do what makes you happy you can't worry about what others think and that's pretty much where I am where where I am with it it's just like why did I, you know, get into this? I got into the planning to basically get myself together. I didn't get into it to basically make a profit right off, you know. So, anyway. So, we covered that up. That's pretty. I haven't used um, tape in a while. Washi tape. So what I'm going to do is just enjoy it because I realized um, when my daughter was home and we sat here and planned and I didn't film or anything like that, I did a better job. I was more creative and I just wasn't worrying about, you know, making something for others, you know, because it was supposed to be just for me. I was supposed to have been, you know, just making things for me, which I still do or I have done. I've made, um, you know, stickers for myself, but then I started thinking about, oh, I want to, um, there we go, you know, I want to make it something that people will buy, and I just totally, totally forgot about myself, so, and the reason why I kind of got into it, so, I'm definitely going back to that, and that way it's more enjoyable for me. And I don't have to worry, you know, about... I won't get frustrated, because I get frustrated real easily. And I don't want to do that. I definitely don't want to do that. You can still see bills to pay. I need to put something here. That flower doesn't go. So, yeah. so And I'm not upset, because sometimes we have to do what we have to do. And we have to be real with ourselves, you know, and just say, hey, it's just not working. Like, it's just not working. Let me try one more piece of tape. See if that'll cover it. This tape is thin. It's cute, but it's thin. So, like, now, I'm really, you know, I feel like my creative juices are flowing. I haven't printed. And that was another thing. I'm just printing, printing away for what <laughs> you know I'm just putting away and wasting sticker paper and like since I've started I'm like on my third or fourth pack of sticker paper ain't sold 
nothing. <laughs> so, you know, I, I, well, I did. I did make some sales, but um, I've just spent more than I've made. And if I'm trying to save money, I have to be real with myself and say, okay, you're not making a profit. Like, so I'm not, like I said, I'm not giving up the shop. I'm just, um, just waiting. And I'm just going to do, do what I enjoy first. So if that means, you know, taking a break from the shop, then that's what it is. Here we go. That looks a little better. I'm going to leave that like that. So down here, what I'm going to put. So yeah, so I'm not, um, like I said, it's not that I'm giving it up. It's just that I'm just putting priorities first and just basically doing what I have to do and to stay focused because I'm going all to the left. I'm not sticking with my budget and, and thinking of budget to do. Let me do this here. Top priority to do. Top priority to do. I think I'm gonna do top priority. There we go. So also, let me tell you all. Uh -oh. Let me, let me pull out my sticker paper. So when I get something, I can just stick it there. So I do my taxes myself. I don't like to do taxes myself. I just do them because I've gotten screwed over so many times. So I just go back to, you know, doing them myself. So I was having this hard time. The day I'm doing my taxes, which I waited till the last minute to do my taxes, uh... I get a letter in the mail the same day stating that, now I got audited back in 2010 for 2008 and 2009. Last year made the last payment. I owed them like $12,000. Made the last payment last year, let them take my taxes. And the same day taxes are due, I get a letter in the mail stating that they want to look at, they want me to send them all this stuff from 2009 like for my 2009 taxes now it is a little weird some people are saying you know that it's not that might be a scam or what have you I don't know if it's a scam or not so I'm a little nervous and I'm thinking I should just kind of not uh, post videos of my pay or what I'm making because as a self-employed person any self-employed person will tell you they don't pretty much claim everything on their taxes or you claim as much as you can but th trust me there's some stuff missing this to be real there's some stuff missing that probably should be there so and I'm about to get into quarterly taxes so I just think for right now it's best that I don't do those videos now I'll say this I'm still going to I'm still thinking about doing let me see I'm gonna put this here on the agenda put that there I'm still thinking about doing like maybe cash envelopes or showing you guys you know what I do or how I plan for the month. Okay, that doesn't work. So we gotta cover this up. Let's get a nice, this box seems cute, but it doesn't seem big enough. Let me flip it. Nope. But I'm gonna get a bigger box and put it there. Let me put this over to the side. So yeah, so that's what's been going on, and I really like planning, and I said in another video that I like planning when no one's home, you know, just having my peace is just real peaceful, and I enjoy it, but I don't want to lose focus 
of why I started planning and I started to lose focus and the same with my um, beauty channel I was doing kind of the same thing I've kind of not necessarily neglected it but I kind of have but I'm trying to stay you know consistent there but when you do things you know not for the right reason it can go astray and you have to do things and I'm, I'm a firm believer in doing things for the right reason so I'm going to find I'm trying to find a box to go here that covers something even if it's plain I may have to go into my let's see you all hear that rain? Ooh, so I'm going to put this here put that there but I think what I'm gonna do is put a little box here to kind of cover that today's focus <clears throat> but again I really enjoy what I do um, even with my beauty channel I love it but I want to stay focused you know I don't want to lose sight of why I started things and like with my beauty channel, at one point in time, uh oh, it's too boxy. Oh, I cut this off for today, part. my beauty channel one point in time I was getting paid from my beauty channel but because I had they changed some of the rules and I had um, just kind of again not necessarily abandoned it but kind of did it went to the side and now I don't get paid so when I realized that I was like oh I gotta post a video I gotta be more accurate on there and I again lost sight of what I was supposed to be doing and then it, it makes you kind of not want to do it I'm gonna cover that up so that's a whole bunch of layering <laughs> I'm gonna put something there since that's a box celebrate so yeah so that's pretty much it on the agenda today's plans remember I'm loving this nude, and I'm kind of. I wanted to. I wanted to kind of plan it out, but I kind of at the same time wanted to just come up with something kind of on the the fly without, you know. Lord, where is my white out? Jesus Christ, where's my white out? Found the white out. Fine time, but I found it. Reason. And then I like to plan in my little room here, my everything room. <laughs> but sometimes, like when I first started planning, I was kind of planning in my dining room. So, where do you all like to plan? You know, that's like the top question of the community. Like, where do you like to plan? I like to plan at a desk. I have to be somewhere flat. Like, some people say they like to plan in their bed. I, I just, it's hard. I don't do anything in my bed but sleep and, you know. <laughs> but other than that, I don't do, I don't plan in my bed. I don't eat in my bed. I don't even look at TV in my bed.
Oh, I gotta put some dates in. Just had some date boxes. That is it. That is my going to be for my everyday. I'm going to figure it out. If I haven't, I will. <laughs> Should I run some washi that way? No. I'm going to leave it just like this. All right. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.